everybody this is alessandro welcome back to my channel last time we did the first part of the blocking plus and today we want to continue moving forward with the second half all right guys mostly we want to go from from the landing over here until the character started to catch up the weight until the uh, hopefully the very end let's see how long does it take all right guys so if i'm gonna focus here normally guys after a big jump okay after we have like a, a, a such a big jump over here a huge distance and everything I want to really feel the impact, okay? And so that's what is really important. Let's assume the kids over here, we have a landing over five frames. Normally what I want is that in a couple of frames, really have a key closer to the next one, okay? And a closer to this one over here, right? Uh, obviously the feet tend to be, I want them both on the ground, right? Maybe here, start to reduce a little bit over here. Maybe this one, I can put the heel down. Uh, something like that. Uh, obviously, I want to go and take a look at the uh, at the trajectory here, right? I don't want them to make it feel um, uh, linear. Okay, I always want to be careful about the arc, right? And another things I want to do, maybe a little bit of overlapping here on the spine, right? So it does not feel uh, completely stiff, all right? I think at this point here we can close this one very quickly. Again, we need sometimes to see how much we need to do in terms of overlapping, right? Right, so we have to drag, we kind of drag the head back a little bit, right? Boom, 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 right? And here, I guess for now, this is sometimes maybe I want to see a little bit better when I go to spline, because it's very tricky to go for, a, for the arm from this position to this one. So maybe here we kind of want to, uh, so now I'll try to keep it simple, right? Because overall, what I'm interested in is the overall flow of the of the landing. Okay, I feel in the COG, kind of going behind and stuff like that. All right. Um, boom. I don't know if actually maybe actually now that I'm thinking maybe it's gonna happen so fast that uh, it, it might make just makes more sense doing this one because or else I will just lose the weight. Okay. Some stuff over here. Okay, yeah, maybe here pushing it up a bit more. Right? And from here what I want uh, um I wanna can I have a little bit of easy in here? I'm gonna keep this one behind, right? So maybe slightly behind here, boom. And pushing it here. And again, just to feel the flow overall, boom. Right? Boom. You can kind of feel the bounciness overall. Yeah, maybe a little bit more down here. And actually, when we go here, we can actually push it even more. It doesn't matter if the legs kind of stretch a little bit. Very little here, and then boom, kind of snap. Okay, and actually what we can do, okay, yeah, just go boom here, boom, maybe a bit. And maybe here, now that it's going down, I'm gonna push it this one a bit more. Maybe this one pushing it down. Okay, boom. Boom, boom. A little bit the head coming down, not too much. Okay, and then here pushing it up. Okay. I know things might look very, very messy, you know, if we're gonna go spline very quickly, but sometimes just to get the idea of the overall weight and everything, 
right? If you're going to the right direction, if the spacing is, is correct. Boom. So for example, I do feel like it's kind of stopping here for a while, right? And I, I don't want that. And so maybe what I want here is more forward. Okay. Right, boom. Okay. Right, and also I noticed that the the, um, the rotation also feel boom. Okay, like maybe more like here maybe, pushing back. And here I want to really feel maybe going down. Okay, maybe uh, feeling the spine. And see how does this feel, right? Boom. And then maybe actually we need to delay, uh, yeah, this one, okay. Okay. Feels a bit too, uh, again, obviously this is not polished or anything, but just, you know, it's good to check once in a while. Okay, push it. Okay. Oops, it's broken. What, what's happening? Okay, boom. And here, yes. Okay. Then obviously we can tweak it, tweak it a little bit more. And a lot of things we can try is like the I feel, yeah, I feel there is some issue in the spacing. So maybe here. We wanna boom like right and see. Yeah, it might feel it's a little bit better here. Sometimes maybe yeah, what we're basically trying to play around here. Maybe just bring everything back about one frame. See how it feels. Also here, it might be beneficial having like another uh, one frame less at the very end to really make it feel more impactful. Okay, and try again. Yeah, definitely started to look like better. Boom. Yeah, this part one is pushing back. Yeah, this one maybe that one. I'm trying to play this part. I think definitely here I need one extra frame. There's nothing I can do about it. a little bit let's take a look one more time a little bit more yeah if it feels a little bit more organic going back there are a few other keys and I want to have here okay so maybe here I want this one on the ground uh, or if it's not on the ground uh, uh, slightly behind And, and so the reason why I'm doing that because I want to drag these things a little bit more behind. Okay, so this one definitely I want it to be flat. Okay, boom, boom, a little bit maybe foot throw, a tiny bit. I want to just this one over here. And then here maybe boom. Alright, because I wanted to solve guys very quickly this problem that I was having with the arm that I felt like it didn't really work from one point to another, right? And basically what, I, what I'm trying to do, just to give you some context, I just draw over the, the very first few poses, right? It's not that I did anything, uh, anything completely new here. So I'm just basically rotoscoping and the reason why I'm doing that is because I want to see the arc of the arm, right? And maybe just adjusting that one, it might help me to uh, understand what kind of shape do I want and, and so on, right? So if I go here and I say, okay, um, this is the um, arc of the hands, right? I have it here, right? One, two, more or less. Here I didn't do it. Uh, here is going to be here, right? And it's here, right? Uh, so if I'm going right here, as you can see, it's boom right here. So... Maybe if I if I if I if I try to draw here, it's like kind of like like this. I did, I I need to imagine obviously a frame where where 
these things could kind of uh, flow, okay? And then I have to say, okay, do, do I want the, the, this key to be here, right? Boom, boom, boom. Uh, do, uh, or do I want the elbow to be like this inside, right? Or maybe I want the elbow to be outside like this, right? Um, so so th that's the thing, like, I'm, I'm, I'm really trying to figure it out here. And I'm afraid that, I mean, I'm afraid. I think the best solution here could be having the, the kind of the, um, the elbow coming down like here, right? Maybe, uh, let me do this part over here. Almost is like a, if I wanted this, right? Imagine, okay, I don't need this one anymore, right? Uh, imagine I want the hands to be here and kind of, right? And then obviously I will do the in-between later, right? Maybe I can figure out the in-between later here. Uh, but at least this, boom, 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 okay? Right. So I think maybe this could be a more efficient way to do the um, in-between. Obviously what I'm going to do is to do the character, right? Uh, I'm gonna zoom very, very quickly. Right. I'm gonna go here and try to really push this thing. Right. Imagine this is it. I'm go this way, right? Uh, obviously, I always need to try the the best I can with the with the limitation of the rig because the proportion. As you guys can see, are are are, are very different, right? The, the character is not gonna uh, match exactly what I want him to be. But at least I need to try to match the position of the hands, right? And and kind of go here. This one, I think, at this stage, I can also uh, uh, remove the grace pencil. Maybe this one. Uh, let me go back, boom, boom. So maybe this one could flow kind of kind of better. And then I can figure out in between later on, right? And maybe here a little bit less so it's all that look like it's touching its nose. All right, guys, and I did another quick modification here, which is basically make it even a one frame faster. So I went from this one, uh, from this one to the contact, and then I, yeah, it would go straight to this frame, and and then the easy out here, and then easy, easy in here and easy out here, okay? So now the other things I'm still not fully satisfied about it is the, um, is the spine. How the spine kind of uh, roll back it feels like everything is kind of moving together uh, all right um, so especially here if we talk about it yeah sure you want to have uh, boom this kind of uh, maybe push it a little bit more here maybe here right and push it again here Again, I don't know if maybe, let me try with this controller very, very quickly. Right. Boom. I hope pushing it back a little bit more, dragging it, dragging it with this. Okay, boom. Right, just to see how things are flowing. Yeah, I started to feel a little, yeah, definitely it's better. Now it feels less mechanic. Okay. And, and now I want to do it a little bit with the neck as well. Okay. You need to be careful because you don't want things to wobble way too much. Okay. Uh, yeah, see like the neck here started to wobble. Okay. Boom. Here. Right. You want to have the feeling. Um, you you want to make sure things are not stiff, but at the same time not to um, 
not too mushy, like they, they are bouncy, they, they are not alive. Let's say, yeah, maybe here, for example, it is a bit too much, okay? Boom, a, a little bit done, yes. And maybe this is slightly too much. Okay, let me actually reset. A little bit more here. Okay. Really need to find the right uh, balance. Maybe same here. Maybe maybe here between this and this. Maybe this is the part where we need, still need to push. And here push it back. Okay. I think for this for this part here it's uh, it's good enough mostly because um I I you know uh, I, I don't want to do polish right now. All right guys. I can go back here, select everything. And so I'm gonna take a look here. Boom. Three, one, two, three, and four. Yeah, I just wanna do a quick in between here. Okay. So I would say for the overall uh, things, I want to leave it normal, right? Kind of no, no huge acceleration. But what I want to do here is definitely um, reduce the foot roll and yeah, maybe pushing this one a little bit more, okay, adjusting it. And definitely what I want is to Push this one a little bit more. Can I make it feel a little bit snappier? Okay. So I want to go down also a little bit more with the shoulder. Okay. And push it up. Okay, boom, boom up and then slightly down okay, I'm gonna feel the shoulder pushing uh, it's gonna be a little bit difficult to see in step mode this is one of the details maybe I can spend a little bit more time when I do the polish spline All right okay so here boom Again, we want to have this very quick deceleration, acceleration. So overall, for this one, for the general movement, I keep it behind in the middle, right? Boom, boom, boom. So it's very, very linear, right? Boom. Maybe this one needs to be a little bit more behind, okay? Push it here. Bring it back. Okay, so it's this one. If a little bit, okay. Boom. Maybe here a bit of foot roll now that I can see. All right. And and yep, one more time things here. The overall maybe uh, this part over here together that I want to have a little bit more of uh, easy in. Boom. Then coming here. And, and here again, quick, easy out. So again, here I'll do a very generic in between first, right? And then from here, when it comes to rotation, right? Boom, pushing it here, boom. 
okay and then maybe this one started to drag a little bit more behind okay boom 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 okay boom boom maybe here this one can go also a little bit forward okay a little bit more here I, and I want to see also the up and down. Now the overall, I want to feel the overall up and down boom. I feel this one. Okay, so yes, yeah, so maybe I want to push a little bit boom boom. Maybe here, let me try to hold it back. Boom, push up here, here. Maybe here it does not need to be the match. Uh, boom, boom. Push it down here. Boom, boom, boom. On here, and then push up. Maybe here we can do foot roll like this. I don't mind if it's stretching a little bit. Okay. Started to feel very, very bouncy. Okay, which is exactly the feeling that I was going for. Right. Quick adjustment I want to give to the head as well, mostly because uh, uh, the head doesn't feel very bouncy at the moment okay so boom boom see here when you coming down you want to have a little bit of bounciness now okay boom boom and then here boom okay up boom here here see you want to come down boom right Okay. Then maybe exaggerate a bit too much, but definitely want to have it a little bit. All right. All right. We're gonna do another couple of steps here, and uh, you notice basically that here the the energy started to decelerate, right? So from here again, I want to have uh, like a, a quick acceleration again here, but instead of doing it every two frames, I can do it every every um, three frames more or less, right? Because as I said, the character is slowing down. So we can go and uh, accelerate and decelerate, boom, boom. So it, it's gonna when you're gonna do the in between and the spline, this is gonna be still gonna feel like a snap, but uh, uh, not too much, okay? And so here we're gonna push this one. Maybe this is slowly behind, okay? Uh, and again, here we want to have this shoulder in the middle position. I always like to see the shoulder going down. Right? Maybe here, this one, we can reduce it a little bit, the foot roll. Okay. Uh, here like this. Okay, boom. And same stuff over here. Boom. Boom. Here, another really uh, slightly over here. But again, this one easy in, stronger easy in, okay? Boom, 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 boom. See, it needs to decelerate a little bit more. May maybe then here, boom. This one could be a little bit more. Yeah, a little bit more here, so it's slightly closer. And we can feel this one. Okay. And obviously, as I mentioned, we're going to take a look at this. I'm going to take a look at the... Uh, I want to feel a little bit more the bounciness, as I, as I, as I mentioned before. Okay. And so, maybe this one can go. Okay. And slowly up. Okay. 
very very quickly let's take a look from the front and same stuff over here maybe again we want to push a little bit more the um okay and same stuff about the head if I roll back a little bit more, boom, boom, up, here, down, down, and here, right? Like at this stage, I don't need to do like the perfect spacing or, or, or anything, right? Boom. If we, we always want to roll back to see if the deceleration feels in it feels okay right as I mentioned never hurt to go back until here plan it very quickly okay and start to see what's uh, what's going on Yeah, it started to feel like a little more appropriate the slow the slow down guys. Um obviously uh requires a lot of polish, but we are not there yet, right? Alright guys, last part of this tutorial over here, right? Is basically we are coming to a stop here, right? And and again, those are the extreme, right? Again, we have like uh, we have like seven frames here. So again, I'm gonna do the acceleration here in uh in, uh, in three frames, right? In three frames more or less over here. And then this kind of coming to a slow down, right? Boom, boom. Okay. Maybe the, as usual, the upper body, I always want to have a little bit more. Okay. Boom. Right. Maybe even a tiny bit more. Maybe even with the rotation here, I can select the rotation only and push it. Okay. We're coming to this one. Right, uh, and from here, boom. We want to see what, how it's gonna happen here, right? So we have, uh, we have kind of four nine frames over here. So maybe I'll try a easy slow down here. Uh, I did here. I need to try more or less. I have to say, uh, this is mostly maybe can be something like this. Right, we are going from here, boom, boom. And and again, maybe here since it's really towards the end. Okay, so, something like that. Okay. Not just me trying at this point, right? Uh, it's not that I always have the, you know, perfect solution in mind. Right, boom, boom. So the other things obviously I want to do, because this is, feels a very mechanical, <laughs> uh, easy in, easy out, right? So as I mentioned, guys, I want to I wanna go here, boom, boom, boom. I want to analyze this last. Actually, let me go uh, in camera view. Maybe it will read bad. Yeah, I want to do this on boom, boom. Push it up. Maybe boom, boom, boom. Here, boom. Okay. Maybe this one needs a little bit more of that. Okay. And the other things I want to take a look. Well, first of all, let me kill this one. Actually, no need to kill it. Let me just go to perspective. And I want to take a look from uh, from. All right. So maybe when we go here. Yeah, the weight is shifting on this direction, on this leg. I want him to go. Right, I will really want to move this direction here. Right. And then here, boom. Boom. 
a little bit more and then bounce back right so i want to have a little bit of waist shift Right. And I feel like there is something here. Yeah, like this rotation, uh, I feel like could be uh... Yeah, to be honest, I think this rotation is supposed to be mostly like this. Okay. I don't feel like that. Maybe a little bit. See, I'm just, I'm just testing right now. Boom. Yeah, it feels a little bit nicer. Right? And another thing I want to do here is delete this one over here. And when, when we're going here, boom, boom. I want to push this direction. Um, yeah, continue to push. Yeah, a little bit less in here. Maybe the shoulder are moving, are moving a bit too much, but I can, I can really. Uh, Yeah, just reduce, uh, and I think it's the Z. Yeah, really make it really subtle. Okay. Come to a stop a character so you can now wanna. And you also wanna have a little bit of uh, of. Uh, A little bit more, right? And then, as usual, take a look at the uh, at the overall. Yeah, there there is something here that is really fast happening, a bit too fast. I feel like it doesn't match the energy of the deceleration. Maybe could, there was a problem there. Oops. Okay. So maybe one of these things could be uh, a little bit better. Okay. And 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 boom. Maybe yeah. Maybe the rotation here. Yeah. It feels a little bit too abrupt. Uh, so I think like here we if, if we do this still we can have a little bit of easy in easy out but yeah yeah definitely better right I think for this stage we can kind of uh, stop here right and then we can continue to polish later on when we're gonna go and do this plan hey guys see you next time ciao